right. Where is it? Where's what? The body. The body? Hmm. The corpus delecti. Oh, I'm not particular. It could be stabbed, strangled, riddled with bullets, mutilated beyond recognition. You're quite right until we find a body. We've nothing to investigate. We're defunct. Obsolete. Out of business. Something's bound to turn up. There's always a body hanging around somewhere. After all, it's only one body we need. I remember discovering three in one night. One was in the closet. Another one was underneath the bed. And the third one arrived on my breakfast tray. It was a four-star hotel. Steve, it'll be a crime if we don't find a body. It'll be a crime if we do. Ah, but then I get a chance to exercise my feminine wiles. Attacked, I fight. Back and forth. Forth and back. I'm losing. No. No? Oh. I leg trip. A prodigious throw. Very good. Meanwhile, I'm invited to dinner by the diabolical mastermind. Of course, it's a trap. He wants to find out how much I know. How much do you know? Ah. You fence with him. Right. Verbally. Eh? Oh. He plies you with champagne. Very nice of him. An excellent vintage. Uh, for a diabolical mastermind. Don't drink it. Poison? Worse. Not. Never fear. Toss the glass in his face. Fell him with a single blow. I burst in shooting. Brrrr. The secret of the double barreled atomic sock knitter is safe. The nation is secure. Feels very strange without a body. Not like home at all. I feel a deep sense of loss. When you think of all the bodies we've had in the past. More than we needed sometimes. Didn't know when we were lucky. The bearskin rug. We haven't looked under there. Steve, you ever heard of finding a body under a bearskin? Bearskin? It is a body. A woman's body. But it's alive. I don't mind. I'll handle this personally. <laughs> 